Hey hi, this is Varsha and welcome to the QA world in my YouTube channel. So basically this is a third video of my Selenium series and uh, again welcome to the Selenium automation series uh, where I'll explain today like uh, how we can close a uh, particular tab, particular uh, browser uh, in Selenium script. So uh, basically Selenium will not uh, close any tab or any browser uh, by default after completing the test execution. So we have to use one predefined method here. I'll explain you in the demo. And in my previous videos, I had covered few topics like how to download and install an IntelliJ, how to create a Maven project, how to add Selenium dependencies basically in pom.xml file, and basically how to uh, build a Maven project. And in my second videos, I had created for writing a first script of Selenium and uh, how we can launch a browser and how we can redirect it to a particular web website yeah so i'm recommending you please go and watch these two videos basically two previous videos so you can get a proper knowledge or uh, if you are beginner and then you can start business with this third videos in this today's videos i'll explain you how to close the browser tab which is currently active in the automation basically i'm using maven project here in this ui automation and uh, the name of my project is sample selenium framework and as you can see the structure of maven and uh, inside the src folder i have uh, main and test folders and inside the test uh, folder i had created one package the name with first test and uh, previously i had also created one class that is a launch browser uh, which i have created for launching the browser and uh, passing this google.com url so let me show you uh, by executing this program like uh, how this uh, browser will open and how the google.com will open and then by default uh, the selenium will not close this browser basically so i just start the execution of this test and you will see like the browser will open and uh, google.com will open but selenium will not close this uh, tab uh, after completing the execution so I think you have observed like this open, but uh, uh, the browser is uh, not closed. Basically the tab is not closed by the Selenium. So to close that particular tab, you have to use uh, one predefined method. Uh, there is a one method in Selenium, uh, which you can call by the driver. Uh, let me write the method uh, driver.close. So basically this is the method as you can see here. And uh, uh, let me just, uh, at the semicolon here so this method will close the current tab so i'm just executing this code and uh, you will see like how soon this selenium will close the browser let me just execute so the browser will open then google.com will open and yeah in a millisecond that tab will close by selenium so uh, actually selenium is little bit fast so we can't uh, observe easily let me put some bait here so you can uh, watch and uh, observe like how this method is working basically let me hold this screen for for five seconds only uh, so let me just uh, execute again and uh, I think uh, for that time you can observe like uh, browser will open and it will wait for five second and then browser uh, that browser will close this yeah so so i'm executing uh, here and uh, that time you can see like how the browser will open and uh, it is waiting it, it will wait for five six seconds basically and then only selenium will close this current tab yeah i hope you have observed right now so this is the way that we can use this close method to uh, closing the current tab basically and uh, this is a very good practice when you are performing a selenium script uh, after uh, completing your test execution you you have to close the browser basically basically it's a good practice to close the browser after performing an automation test case so what exactly this close method does uh, first of all, we will call this close method using a driver, uh, which is an object of web driver interface and uh, this, this driver pointing to a particular tab for running the automation test case. And when we call this uh, close method, it will close that particular tab. So that's it.